Someone recently asked me an interesting question. What's happening to religion in our country? Now that's a huge question. I can't answer it in two minutes. A lot of things are happening. Religion is alive and well in the lives of so many people. I meet them all the time and I'm encouraged and inspired. But also we see that if you look statistically, a lot of people now are less involved and engaged in the living of their religion in more traditional ways. A regular worship on the weekend and all of these kinds of things. There's a scholar at Notre Dame University named Christian Smith who for quite a few years now has been studying this question by looking through the lens of youth and young adults and asking about their religious attitudes and beliefs. And he has written a number of books with his uh, research results. The first of them was called Soul Searching. And one of his conclusions is that among our young people today, instead of uh, the usual traditional ways of living out our religion and understanding it, we're moving into something he calls moralistic therapeutic deism. Big words, moralistic. In other words, religion means being nice to people, being kind, all of that, which it does. Therapeutic meaning a lot of people think about religion as, does it make me feel good about myself? And deism is a way of thinking about God that keeps God in the distance. Therapeutic moralistic deism is not biblical religion that talks about salvation from sin and eternal life and following the commandments. So keep your eye on the dashboard of religion in your life, a life of your family and people you know, and make sure as Christians, we keep coming back to the touchstone, the Lord Jesus Christ.